Today we will see some misconceptions and mistakes related to area of adjoint figures. Misconception 1. If the area of a shape is reduced, will the perimeter also get reduced? Some children think that there is direct relation between area and perimeter of a shape. They think that if the area of shape gets reduced, the perimeter of shape will also get reduced. So, they answer option 1, which is a wrong answer. Suppose we took a square paper of side 4 cm. Its perimeter will be 4 multiplied by length of side is equal to 16 cm. If we remove an equilateral triangle of side 2 cm from this paper, then the area of remaining shape will be less than before. But now the perimeter of shape will be 18 cm. So in this case, perimeter increases and area of figure decreases. Now suppose we remove a rectangle of length 4 cm and width 1 cm from square of side 4 cm. Then the area will get reduced in this case also, but now the perimeter of this shape will be 14 cm. Now, in this case, the perimeter is reduced by reducing the area. Considering all these situations, if the area of any shape is reduced, then we cannot tell whether the perimeter will increase or decrease. Hence, option 2 is the correct answer. Misconception 2 if the length of the side of square is increased by 2 times, then how many times will the area increase? Some children think that by increasing the length of side of the square by 2 times, the area of square will also increase by 2 times. That's why children answer option 1, which is the wrong answer. Suppose the length of side of a square is x. The area of this square will be the square of the side that is x square. If we multiply the length of side of square by 2, then the new length will be 2x. Now the area of new square will be 4x square. If the area of two squares is compared by division, we find that new area is 4 times larger than the first area. In this way, option 2 is the correct answer to the question given. Common mistake Ignoring units The area of a wall is 100 meters square. What will be the cost of painting it at rate of 10 rupees per 1 centimeter square? Some children ignore the unit while solving the question. Here they get 100 rupees multiplied by 10 is equal to 1000 rupees for painting the wall, which is a wrong answer. Here the unit of area of wall is in meter square but the rate is given based on unit centimeter square therefore first we must make the unit same by conversion 1 meter square is equal to 1 meter multiplied by 1 meter since 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter therefore 1 meter square is equal to 10000 centimeter square thus 100 meter square is equal to 10 lakh centimeter square since the cost of painting 1 cm square is 10 rupees, the cost of painting 10 lakh cm square will be 10 multiplied by 10 lakh is equal to 1 crore rupees. Today we have seen some misconceptions and mistakes related to area of adjoint figures.